In this second part, I'm going to show you how to crochet the cuffs of the diaper cover. What we gonna need is yarn. I choose my boshi number 2. A hook size 4 for Europe, size G for US. A tapestry needle. And a scissor. We are going to crochet the cuff completely around the diaper cover now. I recommend to start with the same color of the diaper cover, otherwise there could be a bad difference within the stitches visible. We are not going to cut the yarn, we go on working at this point. We are using single crochet only. At the edges I recommend to use two single crochet into one stitch instead of one to get a better rounding. Go on working with single crochet completely around the diaper cover until you reach the beginning again. We finished our first round. If you want, you can change the color now to create a new ending. I stay green. We are going to continue our work without a slip or chain stitch. Just go on with single crochet. At the edge, it is not necessary anymore to use two stitches. Depend on how big you want the ending, you can start over with a new round of single crochet or you just finish it at this point. Finish the cuff with a slip stitch into the last stitch. After this ensure and cut the yarn. With the help of my tapestry needle I'm going to hide all yarn ends behind the other stitches. Cut the ending. To find out the button position, close the diaper cover. Cut some yarn through the bottom onto the pants. Clothe the diaper cover with a row of triple crochet and done.